Welcome to the world of plants where you think that only animals have bacteria in the gut but in this particular new research initially they were thought that bacteria are found around the root region of plants. This here are the type of bacteria that are important for nutrient cycle but now new research is revealing the other thing that is quite fascinating in the world of plant structure and this all comes down to looking at the stem of the plant and as you get really deep inside the stem in the inner layer we get a fascinating look at different types of bacteria, but they do share something quite interesting when you look at other samples of bacteria along the evolutionary tree. And this particular type of plants, they have these bacteria that are really good at breaking down stuff and releasing methane. Now, you might be wondering, wow, methane is quite familiar. Oh yeah, I thought so because it is a greenhouse gas and we not only know that these particular plants are known for releasing oxygen during photosynthesis but in here now we got something quite fascinating which is methane. Research hasn't shown how much methane is released mathematically but we're going to see how more research dives into this particular aspect and most important thing is that as you get closer to the outer layers of the stem of the plant we get other bacteria that are not similar to the ones in the inside ones but these bacteria according to research they are known to actually capture this methane so who knows what the net methane emission is going to be released by those plants. This article also describes the process that led the scientists to arrive at this particular result and the result was pretty much tracking the amount of methane and also nitrous oxide in those different layers of the inner stem region of the plant and it says that it's around 150 trees that were sampled and 16 species of those trees so it's going to be interesting to see how more data will be needed more sample of trees different regions around the world what are different types of bacteria that are out there how they contrast with other ones that are of a different evolutionary tree and what are the implications of this type of let's say symbiotic relationship between the bacteria and the plant could this bacteria help to destroy a couple of interesting microbes that are maybe harmful to the plant or is it the other way around is it does it reduce the lifespan of plants who knows what this particular bacteria has in store for these plants i guess it's not only animals that release methane <laughs> plants do too